In this video, I'll be telling you free DSA resources that you can follow to crack interview of any company that you want to apply for and not just resources. I will also tell you best way to follow those resources. What happened in the field of DSA that you know the resources, you know channel book, but you are not able to use it properly. For example, like you are trying to open a gate and you are like pushing the gate, pushing the gate, but it's not opening. Then you realize after a some time, instead of push, you have to pull the gate. So you sticker to write on the sticker that you pull it, you don't push it. You were like pushing and you had to pull the gate. So you have to know the right strategy, right uh, way to use a resource in order to maximize your efforts. If you don't want your efforts to go waste, so make sure you watch the video till the end. So hey guys, this is Achinte Gaumat. In this video, we are going to talk about free DSA resources that you can follow to prepare for any company that you want to apply for. So what we are going to talk about, we are going to talk about best YouTube channel that you can follow we'll talk about some three four dsa sheets the purpose of each why you should follow which one at what stage of your proficiency you should follow which of the sheet third we are going to talk about some coding platforms like what is the utility of which which many students are confused like which platform is good for cp like ask, ask someone like how is your cp so they give me ranking of hacker rank lead code etc so this is not what it is so please was that section as well and in the end i will tell you some books that you can follow before we begin this video let me tell you about a very good coding contest code case by coding ninjas in which you can participate and be eligible for uh, internship in 100 plus hiring partners like coin dcx wingify tokopedia medibuddy uh, coverfork eastep and many other companies which are hiring for jobs as well as internship which is open for all year students not not restricted to any third year final year this contest is going to be conducted on 6th of march apart from this there are prizes worth 30 lakh cash prizes in different categories as you can check link is there in the description go right now and register for this coding contest by coding let's first talk about the youtube channel first channel that i would like to tell you about this is the channel i've been following since my college days and this channel has been followed by almost all like greatest coders follow this channel this is the first channel this is the first videos that you should watch when you're starting your journey of dsa it is my code school it, these videos videos are like seven to eight years old created by a guy who's known famous by his code name humble fool so these are very brilliant videos made on basic data structure algorithms uh, stack linked list queue so you should watch it definitely so your basics will get cleared from this youtube channel my code school then uh, if you want to check some specific tutorials for lead code problems then need code youtube channel is very very helpful they have like very focused uh, problem number wise lead code solutions you will find many youtube channels with lead code solution but need code is the best youtube channel third channel we are going to talk about is take you forward by raj vikram aditya i hope you must be aware about he is the most famous youtuber among all the creators so it's a very good channel you can follow for the tree cut tree series dp series recursion series and you can like if you follow this channel i don't think you will need any other channel to follow okay if you have some concerns then you can look at other youtube channels as well fourth i would recommend you the latest channel by love Bubber, code help by love Bubber. so he's teaching you from the very beginning all his youtube videos are very details 2 hour 1.5 hour 1 hour uh, long i have watched many of them while researching for this video i found it very helpful and very like it's a very detailed video so if you are starting from very beginner level so you get all your doubts cleared okay and it's like some bro your uh, friend is teaching you some college buddy of yours is teaching you so his uh, way of talking is very frank so i would highly recommend you to follow code help by love Berber. so these are the four channels i would recommend you if you have any other channel you like or you want to prefer do let me know in the comment section now we talk about the dsa sheets first i would like to mention everybody is aware dsa cracker by love Berber. but let me tell you it's a very exhaustive sheet it, he has mentioned 450 questions i have seen it from top to bottom there are many uh, questions added it's like an encyclopedia of questions there is not many strict strategy followed in it there is no pattern or structure this is like an encyclopedia that you can follow for reference so don't uh, if you are looking for any structured uh, way of looking at your coding at your journey like first day second day third day then this not be a better 
uh, series to follow you can follow other that i'm going to recommend also but if you want to prepare you are just on the learning phase you are looking for a reference guide what questions you can follow then you can definitely follow this but this is just a little uh, inside I wanted to share about this DSA cracker by Love Babbar. Second is SD sheet by Raj Vikram Aditya. This is not a preparation sheet. This is a revision sheet. So once you have learned all your DSA, now you are in your final year, third year, you want to revise your DSA for companies. Companies are about to visit your campus in next month or after two months, then that is the time you should follow this SD sheet. So that is the best time to follow this SD sheet by Raj Vikram Aditya. If you are learning DSA for the first time, then don't follow this okay third sheet is lead code by fraz in this you will find lots of question only for lead code so lead code is the most recommended platform for dsa so you can definitely follow this sheet if you are looking to solve some good quality problem in a structured manner on lead code last sheet i am following telling you it's a 65 day strategy created by siddharth singh all these questions are of different platform interview bit gfg and lead code etc you will find on multiple platform i have found it very helpful from it takes you from a basic level and takes you to a very high difficulty level so you can definitely follow this sheet if you are looking for a structured way to approach your coding and want to achieve a high level of proficiency then this sheet can be very helpful to you link is there in the description now we will look at the best coding platform and how you should use them the first platform that you should start with is hacker rank many students what they do they start with lead code or any other platform then they find it very difficult as a beginner the only platform you should start from is hacker because it has many beginner friendly problems that you should start with which creates your logic from a very fundamental level so what you should do you should learn a language c plus plus java python and start solving at least 30 to 40 beginner level problems on hackering then you should learn some more data structure like stack array string etc then you should go and start solving these problems on lead code or gfg lead code is more preferred for dsa because it has a very uh, you can say rich set of problems which is more specific for companies and it has also become an industry standard but gfg also has all such problems and uh, some problems are more on gfg as compared to lead code but lead code is just accepted so that's why it's more popular but there is no other specific you can choose any platform which you like okay so for uh, you should start with hacker rank solve at least 20 30 40 problems basic problems in hacker rank then you should learn some more data structure like stack array queue linked list theory was theory solve then you should solve related problems to them on lead code and gfg then you should complete your theory of dsa etc then you should solve some interview centric problems on interview bit interview bit is a platform where you will find most commonly asked problems uh, tagged by company like Amazon, Goldman Sachs, Microsoft. So that is not a very rigid way to know which company is asking which problem, but you will get some generic idea like which company is asking which category of questions and you can prepare accordingly. If you want to go for CP, you can go for CodeChef and CodeForces and all these platforms prior I have discussed Hacker and GFG, LeadCode. Uh, interview bit these are not counted as cp platform code chef and code forces is the platform which is counted as cp platform so if you want to go for cp then after doing all these steps you can go for code chef and code forces you can participate in contests or you can just solve standalone problems there as well but problems individually don't have any value only if you participate in contest and solve some live problems then only it will have some value if you have any other query please let us know in the comment section apart from this you will also find many other platforms those also have some benefits but these are the best platform that you should definitely code on for the books part i would only recommend you two books i will not tell you any curriculum books which will teach you data structure algorithm will teach you any specific language that you can follow if you want but technically it is not needed the way of learning has changed get out of like following a book or something like that it is like a changed world when i was in college in 2012 13 14 that was the time to study from books i think the behavior has changed so adopt to newer methods of learning but still if you want some book then there is a book called algorithms made easy by narsima karumanchi it is available for all three programming languages c plus plus java and 
python you can easily find the pdf or you can also buy it it's a very uh, affordable book and once you buy it you will be using it like four five years when you're working in the company industry as well so it's a very good book it will take you from the basic concept ask you to optimize your approach then further optimize then further optimize so i have read it personally many chapters of it so it's a brilliant book so just go for it but if you want more book then you can follow cracking the coding interview uh, i think that is the right name if i'm uh, mistaken so please forgive me by luck that is also very good book recommended by all software engineers interviewers students who are getting interviewed and all the people in the industry it has a very rich set of problems and tells you a very good approach to problem solving i hope i have given you all the information that you need all the links that i have talked about in the video you will find in the description if you have any query you can comment in the comment section or you can whatsapp us as well we will definitely respond to you whenever i get 